Whatever happened to predictability? The milkman, the paper boy, the evening TV. You miss your old familiar friends with waiting just around the bed. This is Gabby. Okay, okay. Go ahead, Medic 5. All right, so we have a 78-year-old female patient. Okay, let's, okay, so shortness of breath. Okay, fever of 102.3. Okay, all right, vital signs. Okay, we're gonna see you soon. Room assignment upon arrival. All right, okay, thank you. My name is Gabby. I'm going to be the nurse today. So what's been going on? Well, she, was, she wasn't feeling good for a couple of days and then she started getting more tired and, and getting worse and we thought maybe she was developing pneumonia or something, but we don't know. Has she had pneumonia in the past? Yeah, she has, and but it's never been this bad and we lost our insurance so we just we had some antibiotics left over and so we just started those and thought maybe it'd kick it and, oh, it's and never, go away. It's never good to use old antibiotics because they don't really work as well. It should it isn't recommended. I'm glad you guys came in though. Let's uh let's just take her vitals again. Okay. Alright, so the machine over there reads well. Okay, so her blood pressure is 100 over 55, her pulse is a little high, it's 118, her respiratory rate, I've been noticing, is a little high, it's 28 at this time, and her temperature was 102.9. Oh my gosh! Yeah, I know, what we're going we're gonna to do some diagnostic tests and check her out. And her O2 saturation does look a little bit low, it's 89, so we'll get some oxygen. Okay? Okay. Nurse Malaria, Mrs. Burns' blood pressure is becoming lower than before. It's really, her heart rate's increased horribly, and her O2 saturation's going down in the 80s. Oh no! Put her on four liters of oxygen stat, and we need to call the doctor right away. I've assessed her pain and her mental status. She's completely delirious at this time. She's showing signs of poor perfusion with the decreased blood pressure, and she's starting to have cold blue extremities. <gasps> According to the labs, her white blood cell count is high, most likely due to infection. However, her bands are high due to a rapid production of immature cells. You know, her platelets are low. This can lead to internal bleeding. Her bun creatinine and CRP are all high, most likely due to the body's inflammatory response. Her kidneys must be taking a real beating. Her lactic acid is also high. It's most likely due to her metabolic acidosis. Well, we better begin treatment. We just got the doctor's orders. Okay. It's a drug overdose, isn't it? No, I don't think it is. Allergic reaction? No, it doesn't sound like that with no hives. Oh, it must be sepsis then. I think it might be. Well, we have lactated ringers, which are used to induce urine output due to your mother's renal failure from the sepsis. The dopamine is used to treat her circulatory problems from her low blood pressure. We also, oh I know, we also have vancomycin and rifabin. 
as antibiotics okay, used okay. their antibiotics used to treat her infection for her pneumonia. So are these gonna help her? They're gonna help her, aren't they? Yes, we're hoping that these help uh, pretty fairly quickly. Okay. All right, so it looks like one of the other nurses is gonna come in and check vital signs. Hi, Mrs. Barnes. I'm Nurse Malaria, and I'm here to do your vitals. <laughs> Relax your arm for me. Oh, Mom, I hope you're going to be okay. What are her vitals? Well, she has a blood pressure of 92 over 50. Oh my gosh. Her heart rate's up to 127. Oh my goodness. Her respiratory rate is 29. Oh my gosh. Her temperature's 103.1. Oh no! And her O2 sats are 84%. Oh no! What are we gonna do? I have Mrs. Barnes new medications. Oh my gosh, what does she need new medications for? Well, she's still receiving the dopamine for her low blood pressure. Oh gosh. She has a new order for Zosin, and this is gonna help treat her infection better. We'll also be checking her lactic acid levels often to ensure that her treatment is effective at this time. Oh my gosh. And the chest x-ray is gonna help us get a better image of her lungs. Does she seem like she's doing any better? You know, she actually seems to be doing better. She seems to be stable, and her vital signs, which just took five minutes ago, show a blood pressure of 118 over 90, a heart rate of 90, a respiratory rate of 16 on the ventilator. Her temperature is 99.7, so it's gone down significantly, and her O2 saturation is currently 92%. It's That's looking, good, isn't it? It's looking a lot better. Okay. Your mother's vitals seem to be doing much better. Her blood pressure has gone up to a safer level and her oxygen levels are much safer. We'll be performing a sed sedation vacation for your mother. What is that? That's where we bring her off of the medication that's keeping her sleepy and okay. we make sure that she can breathe better on her own. Okay. So what are you going to do after that? Well, we're going to assess whether or not she's ready to come off of the ventilator. And if okay. she is, then that's a good sign. Okay. I hope so. But until then, we need to make sure to keep your, your mom's bed elevated to 45 degree angle. Okay. And we need to make sure that we brush her teeth and moisten the inside of her mouth a little bit. Okay. So you're going to see nurses come in and do things like that and reposition her from side to side and on her back every couple of hours just to make sure that she doesn't get sores on her high knee. Okay. I don't want sores. We don't need any more. It's just one thing after another right now. She is looking so much better. Mrs. Barnes, how are you feeling today? Much better. I get to go home. You know, that's great. I'm so happy. You know, it's been a really, really, really long roller coaster ride for you here. Well, she wouldn't have had such great care if it wasn't for you awesome nurses. Thank you so much. Well, thank you. Uh, by the way, do you remember what we discussed? Yes. Don't take old antibiotics. It's never a good idea. Well, we're going to miss you guys. Yay!
<laughs> Nurse Malaria, Nurse Gabby. I'm not dead. <laughs>